How the hell y'all doing? Clint Frank through our way to do another one of those reviews you love oh so much today, Saturday, August 12th, 2023. Uh, we're going to be doing a record by a band, uh, a style I would not normally do too often, but uh, this band has really impressed me. They have a ton of records out before this one, but I've never really heard them before. Uh, they are called Hail the Sun, um, and the album is called Divine Inner Tension. It is 12 tracks long. It's on Equal Vision. Uh, it's on CD, digital, and LP that I know of. Uh, it is a mix of emo, post-hardcore, and metallic screamo is the best way I can say. Uh, if you like bands like uh, Coheed and Cambria, uh, Dance Gavin Dance, and uh, My Chemical Romance, this is going to be for you. Uh, it's a very different kind of album for me to review, but man, the hooks and the prog elements and the heaviness and just... The creativity of this is impressive. Uh, let's listen to the very first song off of uh, uh, Hail the Sun's uh, Divine Intertention. It is called Tunnel Vision Alibi. <laughs> listen to those goddamn hooks and the catchy riffs uh and those higher register vocals that work so well with kind of the emo post-hardcore uh metallic tones that are going on here uh again uh hail the sun uh came out yesterday on uh, equal vision records uh the album is called divine inner tension we are going to listen to another track off of this. We're actually going to listen to several of the 12 tracks. Uh, but the next song is going to be track number four. It's called 60 Seconds, uh, sorry, 60 Minute Session Block. Uh, it's one of my favorite songs on the record, so here we go. I told myself I shouldn't care.
know it's never going to get huge radio airplay, but it's a damn shame because back in the 90s, early 2000s, this would have been a huge uh, heavy rock uh, kind of uh, octane radio Cirrus XM kind of band, and uh, it would have gotten tons of college radio airplay. Uh, again, Hail the Sun is just catchy, heavy, different. Uh, I love the elements of, like I said, those three bands, uh, Dance, Gavin, Dance, uh, Coheed and Cambria, um, and My Chemical Romance all kind of mixed in together. Um, there's some kind of like metallic screamo stuff too, like I said, and you'll hear it in a bit. Uh, but we're going to listen to track number eight next, and that's called I Saw You Hanging, and uh, here we go. A decaying butterfly Experience I deny criminal goddamn thing in rock and roll it's actually a good thing uh and like i said when bands do it well like this hell yeah um kind of reminds me of mars volta at times too maybe i'm crazy about that uh but we're gonna listen to one more track and it's the very next track and it might be my favorite track on the entire record um other than 60 minute session blocks uh it's called tithey and uh here we go
be a complete goddamn moron not to get this record and listen to it all the way through several times. Uh, again, uh, Hail the Sun. Uh, it is out on Equal Vision Records uh, yesterday. CDLP and digital that I know. Divine Intertention is the name of the uh, record. Uh, there are five pieces out of California. And again, if you like stuff like Dance Gavin Dance, uh, Issues, uh, if you like uh, Coheed and Cambria, my Chemical Romance, uh, I'd even say uh, Mars Volta. You will absolutely love this band. Uh, so I will leave links uh, on how to be able to get the record and to their social media. Uh, and if you like what I do, please like and subscribe to the Doorway 2 magazine on BitChute, Instagram, Rumble, YouTube, and or Odyssey. And this was a record I just reviewed. It wasn't sent to me. I found it and I fell in love with it. So equal vision and hail the sun. Uh, man, get me on the mailing lists and uh, make sure that uh, equal, vision, equal vision sends me more stuff because if it's like this, I definitely need to hear it. All right. Well, until next time, this is Clem from the Doorway 2. 